you want to have armor that looks like this, well check out the steal of an add-on by True Cowboy. Alrighty guys, so before we hop into the video, we of course need to set a little like goal. So in this video, let's see if we can go ahead and get 30 likes on this video. So go down, hit the like button. It takes like four seconds, but let's hop into this thing. How's it going everyone? Welcome back to another Minecraft add-on showcase. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get into this thing. So we will be taking a look at Steel Plus by True Cowboy, as you can see. And yeah, it's a great add-on so far and lots of cool stuff. But we hop into our first crafting recipe. This will get you started in the add-on. Basically, you're going to take one piece of iron and surround it by coal. Then you get this item right here. This item is called iron and coal, believe it or not. Um, I wish it was called like steel powder or something. I think it would flow a lot more smoothly, personally. Basically, you get these steel nuggets out of here. Well, once you get these steel nuggets and you have enough, you need to put it in a 3x3 three three crafting grid like this, and you get one steel ingot. And in order for you to make armor, you're going to need a whole bunch of these. So you're going to need a whole bunch of this iron and coal. Basically, to make the armor, it's like a normal Minecraft crafting recipe. You basically just put it in whatever uh, four more piece of armor you want. And this is how you get it. But this is the armor right here. It is absolutely insane. As you can see, just check out the detail. I love the little armor flaps go in. The different colors, the mask especially. I feel like I'm shocked that Minecraft hasn't adopted one of these types of armor sets already. Um, here's also an axe. This is everything you can craft out of this steel armor. Um, sword, helmet, chest plate, pants, boots, pickaxe, axe, shovel, and hoe. And then obviously... Here are some stats. So every item in this add-on has a durability of 13.52. The sword does 8 damage. And then this is an armor of 22. So you'll get 22 points of defense or durability, shielding, whatever Minecraft calls it. Now, you may be wondering, well, how do you, how do you get the dark one? Like you showed us in the video. Well... This add-on has a lot more stuff to add. I actually need a pickaxe real quick. Cool. I'm going to go game mode survival for y'all. So, in order to get the, the dark steel stuff, it says it here. To get the dark essence, you must obtain the new dark essence ore. Breaking it will expel the dark essence in the form of gas. You need an empty bottle to right click or interact. The generation of the ore is very low. Um, it spawns between negative 64 and 10. Um, you can right click or interact with the phone to also get the essence. That's for uh, Micro Pocket Edition users. So you're going to go ahead and take glass bottles here. This is what the ore looks like. I try to make it a little pretty, but basically, when you mine it, you're not going to get anything. You're going to get this gas. And you basically just right click. Until it goes away. So you can get a decent amount of bottles as you can see. And that gives you this dark essence here. You can't drink it or anything. I wish you could like drink it and like. Have it instantly kill you or something. That would be funny. But in order to craft dark armor. You basically take the steel armor. Pieces that you crafted from over there. And you surround it with dark essence. And that gives you the Dark Essence chest piece. As you can see, this armor is no joke. It's beautiful. I love the design of the tools and stuff like that. The sword has a very clean design. As you can see, helmet looks fantastic. Here's the back side of it. You can craft everything you can in the steel. Um, sword, helmet, chest plates, pants, boots pickaxe, axe, hoe, and shovel. So now, this also has a durability of 1352 per piece. Um, damage is 8 plus with the special ability that I'll show you. And this armor is 24. That armor over there is 22. So this will be the, probably the highest armor in the game. Now, 
this is has to do with the special ability so dark power one equals each piece of item so if i was to actually take um i think if i take these pants off you can see it says plus one dark power dark power one equals each piece of armor increases your weapon damage by one having all armor gives you an extra four damage but using the dark steel we weapons increases this amount if you use a dark steel tool or weapon, your damage is increased by two per piece. Having all armor will give you an eight extra eight damage if you were to use a dark steel weapon. So you're basically doing 16 damage. If I was to put on each of these. Yeah, let's let this, this out. Going off script here. And you're holding this. I have everything. Dark Steel Sword. I should just be able to one-shot everything. Baby Sheep, you're dead. Um, let's summon... Summon... Warden. Oh, it's also peaceful. As you can see, though, the Warden has still hits like a tank. Alrighty guys, well, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Obviously, it's not strong enough to take on a warden, but I think we were pretty close to killing him, if I could say so myself. Um, please like and subscribe as you see fit, and I'll catch you all on the next one. Thanks to True Cowboy for making this amazing add-on, and have a good day. Goodbye!